Okay, the next thing I'm going to show is um, this is a lot of times when you first get mount or maybe you didn't properly fast, uh, smash his face or he escapes the face smash. Sometimes guys will kind of turn up on their side here and you, don't, you can't have his face down. Their arms are nice and tight and they'll like, try to push to get your lip to hook one foot and escape that way. So, um, like I said, Jiu Jitsu is anyone that trains is not always a perfect world. So things aren't going to always work out perfect. So let's say I get here, I'm unable to smash his face. Exactly, he's pushing me here. So what I do is I see how I curl my feet really high. I don't want him to be able to hook the, uh, the feet. That's how he's gonna escape, he'll one of my feet. So I'm really high. And this is, I was telling you always have your ass down. This is an exception because there's always exceptions to Jiu Jitsu because I need to keep my hips, hips high and he can't. I'm also riding him kind of high so he doesn't have, but I'm down low, he can straighten his arms. But see, my hips are high now so he can't get a bunch of pushing force. Now from here, I want to refight his face down. It's not always easy, especially if his face, a lot of times his face is tight here, but look, I'll grab his head and kind of ratchet, ratchet, ratchet. Now I've got position. Now I can go back to here. So one more time, see he's sideways here, he's fighting, he's pushing. See I'm hiding my feet, I'm pulling my feet up so he can't really push me back. Now I catch his head and I'm aggressively turn, turn, turn. See how I've re-smashed my foot. He's probably pushed the arm, isolate. They start looking from attacks from there.